How do you make Eamon Holmes <laughs> 12 inches long? Ooh. Oh, I do remember this one. That'll have a like for me. That yeah, one. I remember this. Bend it enough. Bend it enough. Joe, um, as I say, I've been a fan of you for many, many years. That's very nice. And, and one thing I love that you it's your <laughs> tweets right oh i haven't done them in years no i know but i've found some old ones oh dear God. right and they're fucking brilliant i remember vividly i don't know how i have this memory but i remember about three or four years ago my dad's a fan of you as well and i stood in his kitchen <laughs> he was on day release and, uh, <laughs> and uh, i was just reading him your tweets and we were just in in bits oh, so um i'm just going to read a couple of your tweets now and see if you can remember how they end oh god yeah. <laughs> i feel like i uh I deserve this. It's official. The cockiest place to do a line of drugs is off the... No idea. <laughs> the little conveyor belt that takes your luggage through the x-ray machine. <laughs> the okay. <laughs> okay. I'll use that tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Lee Dixon's head looks like one of those... <laughs> <laughs> like one of those. Did I end it there? <laughs> Realistic looking cakes. <laughs> I've got I loads of these. I can't giggle at my own. I don't remember. You can giggle. Yeah, you you can. can giggle. Songs of praise is full of. <laughs> <laughs> what is that out of the corner of my eye? <laughs> it's full of arse today. <laughs> I, I know. I remember tweeting that on a Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Joe saying this. I think I have a really nice looking. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say cock. <laughs> I thought you said that. In my ear. <laughs> I was just saying cock. You were whispering. Cock. I said I definitely didn't say. Cock. <laughs> I think I'm a really nice looking cock. I think I have a really nice looking lap. lap. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why am I always remembered as that guy who... Honestly, I don't remember anything. <laughs> shouted yuck at a christening. <laughs> this one's brilliant. This one. How do you make Eamon Holmes knob 12 inches long? Ooh. Oh, I do remember this one. That'll have a like for me. That yeah, one. I remember this. Bend it enough. Bend it enough. Bend it enough. Just tried cocaine. It had no effect on me. P.S. Does anyone have Miss World's number? I feel I'm really in with a chance. <laughs> wow, celebrities are fit. <laughs> oh, maybe I should do Twitter again. Yeah. This oh, is my awful, awful thing. You've got three, up, three more. Okay. It's amazing how rude waiters can be when they know deep down. How are you going to do a runner? <laughs> Changing one letter turns my favourite sweets into jelly tits. My favourite sweets being jolly tits, of course. They're Swedish. It's the best Swedish. <laughs> <laughs> uh, these are just these are great. Oh, it's so hot. <laughs> <laughs> we can stop there because you're you're dying inside, aren't oh, you? Oh, well, that's um, that's a throwback. <laughs> right, look, last one, last one. I'm in the thirty-eight percent of people that can. No idea. <laughs> remember, <laughs> remember everything about their own birth. <laughs> What's wrong with me? <laughs> what I admire most about Andy's Andy Murray's mum is that she still insists that she doesn't have a favourite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm the really, best. I'm really stressed. <laughs> Why are you sure? Oh, I oh, I'm sort of because I'm giggling. I think I'm giggling at you giggling, but it looks like I'm laughing at myself. I don't remember them. <laughs> you are. I mean, it's like a paradox <laughs> of hell. <I> <laughs> That's a title for our next tour, Paradox of Hell. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. I'm not laughing, but I'm laughing at you, but look, I feel like so self <laughs> Just laughing at your own tweet. <laughs> it's really, it's very really sweet that you're laughing. I think I'm sort of just very sweet that you're laughing. So I'm like, oh, that's lovely. I thought, well, I'm getting carried away. <laughs> I think I'm getting carried away. That you laugh. Oh, <laughs> right. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. I, we normally ask our guests about their their childhood and how that was. But I read an article last night in which you said that your childhood in Kent was mundane. 
Yeah, that's fair. That's pretty much. That's <laughs> that's most I've ever expanded on that as well. I think. Yeah. So what, um, yeah, I think most people's was though, wasn't it? I think I did. I did. I did a stand-up show, embarrassingly, about about sort of just yeah, just having a uh, a mundane life. Basically. Did that lead you to do any weird things though? Because I remember as a kid, I'll kick this off, and maybe you boys can jump in. I did this thing with my cousin, which I've never really. <laughs> which one's this? Not not yeah. that one. All right. Um, um, not but... that one is a no. sentence you want to hear. And move on from. <laughs> <laughs> not that one. Of course, that's all I'm thinking about. We used to. Let's talk about that one. <laughs> Say not that one. Then sort of <laughs> I kind of want that, that one as well. <laughs> you know the old yellow pages, the books. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. We used to we would go round before people collect them, and we took as many of them as we could, and then we found oh. this garage, and we just filled our garage <laughs> with yellow pages for no reason, <laughs> for no reason whatsoever. How do I feel about that? <laughs> um, how do I feel about that? <laughs> I think if I was, yeah, I'd go, oh, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, it's been a long summer. <laughs> Did neither of you look at each other and ask why you're doing it? Nah, we kind of like, there was one day where we had like a couple of rows missing from the top and we like jumped in it. It was very hard. It wasn't, it wasn't comfortable. <laughs> Whose garage was it? Uh, it was one, it was my neighbours moved out. And they left it unlocked. Left it unlocked. My nan's neighbours left it unlocked. So, mm. yeah. like that, do you know that is a good play thing, actually? Yeah. Like an empty garage. Yeah. That's good fun. It was good fun. Yeah, yeah. I think I'll be honest with you. If I thought of doing that, I'd I'd probably tell people. That's yeah. A good, that's a good use of an empty garage. Yeah. Yeah. Fair. Mm. Uh, we, so we had that, and then we'd get, and then we got loads of empty cans of like Vimto, Dr Pepper, whatever, and then that would be the outer shell of it. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> so support. Yeah. Oh, great. I wouldn't. I wouldn't change a thing of that. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely wouldn't change a thing. <laughs> the same as your childhood, the same stuff. Yeah, I think yeah. we. I, I, I think I'd go. Yeah, you can join. <laughs> this kid's. This kid's got something. <laughs> this kid's got ideas. This, kid, this kid's gonna have a podcast. <laughs> Did you do anything weird like that? Uh, I don't think I had enough get up and go. If I'm honest, <laughs> it... I was very much. I was quite um, lethargic. Believe it or not, to look at me now. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've travelled here, haven't I? Sort of yeah. Two trains. <laughs> yeah. uh, no, I'd, I used to have a paper around, around your neck of the woods, and um, it was, I don't know if they, they don't do it anymore because of the bloody internet, but um, free papers, you know, the free papers thing. Yeah. So, hmm. so we had this, and uh, I used to um, take the 350 papers, that, and I would put them, Looking back, this terrible idea, but there was at the end of my friend's road, there was one of those um, like fenced off things that had like very high voltage. Oh, substation. Yeah, yeah. Substation Maybe. thing. Yeah. yeah, just in the middle of like just just at the end of a road to be like this one was at like a a cut through path. You know, yeah. one of those ones that would get from someone's road to someone's road, so you didn't have to sort of walk all the way around. Yeah, and uh, I used to pour. All the papers in there every week, yeah, into a thing that said this has thousands of volts <laughs> hurtling through it, <laughs> and I lived in constant fear of killing people, <laughs> but I would not stop doing it. Are we going to take that clip? And that's going in the fucking trailer. <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm happy with that. Yeah. Uh, I think it's a fair summary of the first 15 years of my life. <laughs> but I would, I'd have sleepless nights thinking, wow, there's going to be like a fire that takes out several hundred houses. But you kept doing it. I kept doing it. Why couldn't you stop? I'm a creature of habit. <laughs> Simple as that. So it became habitual of yeah. paper. Yeah, I was like, that was, I'd take it out. And then I'd have to wander wander about for a bit because I couldn't come straight home so I'd wander about for a bit worried sick <laughs> it's really odd it's and really then... odd <laughs> so basically Talk no nothing yourself. odd no, no. <laughs> but I only think that because you're you're you kind of did a similar thing yeah without the possibility of um mm. endangering lives no mm. 